The most surprising thing about Alpha was my experience of the Holy Spirit. Wow, what was that? <laughs> Um, my friend Christopher invited me to come to Alpha a long time ago, almost, it kind of took almost a year. I arrived feeling apprehensive and nervous. It was rainy and dark and I had to go into a Catholic church which I wasn't used to having been raised in Protestant churches and then I got down here to this lovely warm space and lots of very personal greetings and welcome and it felt like people greeted me with the same kind of bright eyes and smile and attention whether they knew me or not. It's really nice. I came to Alpha curious about faith, because I have definitely described myself in um, church settings as anything from atheist, absolutely sure God did not exist, to agnostic, to um, I think the strongest I would have ever described it as um, hopeful and curious and positive about the possibility of God and faith. No matter how distracted I was, I left feeling I had spent time thinking about profound and important things that mattered to me and being with a group of people whose um, values, whether or not their faith was at the same place or further advanced, they, um, we were talking about things that were important in such a respectful, kind of curious, um, sometimes playful way. There was a time described as worship and we'd start with singing and the music was like so playful and fun and um, fresh and not what I expected in the Catholic Church. I'm sorry to go on about that, but <laughs> I was like, oh, I like this music. And um, people actually sang out loud. It was nice. I wouldn't rank the weeks. It was the experience of coming and I didn't, I didn't make it to every week. I, I gave myself one week off because I ended up being late and feeling guilty and I thought actually I think Alpha is a place where it's okay and I don't need to scramble but it was the whole experience from literally the design the original invitation to coming through the door each day and how I left each week to to how the shape of the whole course was so well designed to keep going over ideas and tugging at things and it sort of allowed me to leave after 10 11 12 weeks um, with quite a reinforced um, curiosity, which I talked about, but also brave enough to say I'm a Christian and I'm a person of faith. So part of the Alpha course is this weekend away, and that felt like such an ask to arrange, you know, dog care, <laughs> child care, um, and somehow the repeated invitation um, with a little bit of strength and pull, both push and pull, um, got me to the weekend away at Worth Abbey. On the Saturday night of the weekend away, so it was the second night, which is nice, because we were sort of settled, settled, but also we had that kind of feeling of like, tomorrow we, we close and say goodbye. We had a time of worship, and then there was an offer to, to um, be prayed over. And I, I found that intimidating and a bit too intimate. Um, but actually, the way that, um, the way that the session was led and the kind of opportunity for, for reflection and privacy as well as, um, as well as music, it allowed me to address these um, feelings of anger and confusion about faith. And I can't say that it was enjoyable in any way and other people had said they felt the Holy Spirit and they had felt great relief. That wasn't my experience but then um, what did happen was this massive dam, this massive um, blockade of honesty, this blockade between um, God and faith and I uh, was shifted. And in the, in, so certainly over that weekend in that glorious space and also in small moments um, in conversation and big moments in the natural world along the river and in the hills and that kind of thing that I definitely had this growing sense of the Holy Spirit being with me. I would like to invite uh, anyone, most people I meet, uh, to Alpha because what a, what a grand human experience. 
whether you're Muslim or not a person of faith um, or, um, you know, people crave understanding why they're here and having a safe place to reflect on who they are and all the stories that have shaped our definition of ourselves wherever you were raised, because I have really lived all over the world. Um, and that is strikingly common that we need to make sense of our lives and why we're here and have some purpose. And Alpha has been the most um, clever and curious and fun and graceful experience of that um, important work. Why are we here?